freaking dark. What can we do about this now? It's way too dark to film, but it's winter time. Welcome to the Netherlands. Let's see what, can, what we can make of it. Make it like this. It's just so freaking dark. It's three o'clock in the freaking afternoon. Is this even worth it? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Maybe like this? The struggle to make a video in the Netherlands in winter time. Let's just begin, shall we? Hello my beautiful friends and welcome to the December favorites. I want to wish all of you once more a very happy 2018. May all your dreams and wishes come true. I hope you will join me on my journey this year again as well, of course. And we're starting off the new year with looking back on a very nice and cold but warm December month in which I actually had a lot of nice, cute, green, bohemian, hippie, goodies and all that and I'm gonna share those with you today. First and foremost. My new jacket from Fjallraven is amazing. It's amazing. This is the first time ever that I have an actual very high quality, very warm jacket in winter time. And I'm the type of girl who is always cold, who's always freezing, who can't think straight in winter time, basically. And I have to say, wearing this just, like winter is no issue anymore. I'm just loving it. And I also really like that it has like a bright color because especially on days like these, when it's so gray, so dark, so gloomy, then it's something like a pop of color in the world, you know? So I'm also really loving this. So what I really like is that they take a lot of responsibility in uh, where their products come from and how everything is made. So it's one of the more sustainable brands that you can choose from as an outdoor brand, basically. And for me, this is my first time ever that I have had such a warm jacket in winter time. I'm getting crazy warm as we speak as well but I am absolutely loving it. It's just like, it's no struggle at all anymore to go outside. You really notice the quality. As you can see, it's fairly big. I feel like a teddy bear, but at the same time, it's also quite feminine. So this one is called the Singy Down Jacket. I absolutely love the whole model and I also really like the big pockets and everything. I mentioned this brand before as well. I just really like the style, the vibe, uh, the high quality actually. And yeah, I'm just, super incredibly happy with this new coat. Let me know what you think. Second favorite are these goodies from Rock Your World. So this brand really wants to focus on the inner beauty in a time where we don't really take time for ourselves anymore. I really love the modern design, but I also really like the symbolic meaning behind it. So this is Rock Your Energy Be Fresh Aura Spray. What you basically do is just spray it over your head like this. Amazing smell with all kinds of good essential oils, of course. Spray above your head for an instant effect on your senses. So this is an aura spray. They have all kinds of aura sprays. And this one is a roller. Here it says, roll on pulse points to support new beginnings. This one is called Rock Your Mood. Also an amazing smell. Of course, all natural ingredients, they really use the positive characteristics from crystals and essential oils, basically. So yeah, lovely brand, love the style, love the symbolic meaning, and all in all, it's a gentle reminder to simply say to yourself or to your friend, like, hey, take good care of yourself. So I can really recommend to just check out their website. They really have like all kinds of themes, like rock your mood, rock your energy, uh, rock your mind even so yeah i just think this is a very nice gift maybe to give to yourself but especially if you're looking for something more symbolic for a friend yeah i really love this it's dutch even by the way also a nice detail to share of course on to the next favorite a tiny little detail my earrings again how can i show them now i got these for christmas actually and they are from anna plus Nina. And this is a pretty well-known store in Amsterdam. When you come to Amsterdam, definitely check out this store. Everything is amazing. But especially their jewelry is a little bit more raw, edgy, kind of eccentric here and there as well. And yeah, I'm really happy with it. It's uh, gold-plated on sterling silver. And 
and I think yeah this one has a tiny bit of a rock and roll vibe as well to it and I'm really happy with it so I just wanted to share this cute little gift that I got then this very cute makeup bag or well whatever you want to use it for I use it for my makeup from Kindred Spirits I really like the boho touch to it it's an awesome size actually I think it's kind of perfect for your makeup and uh, it has like a good nice zipper and yeah I really like the the style again I have shared my boots from them as well all in all it's just a very nice brand for your um, yeah bohemian vibes all in all and uh, this is just like nice little details you know it's all about the details okay then of course winter time we need to share something like a movie or a documentary or whatever and this time around I want to share with you Jim and Andy the great beyond featuring a very special contractu contractually contractually oh my god obligated mention of Tony Clifton what a name <laughs> Anyway, you can find it on Netflix and what I personally find fascinating about this documentary basically what you need to know long time ago there was this movie Man on the Moon Jim Carrey played Andy Kaufman Andy Kaufman is a comedian from the 80s the only thing that a lot of people didn't know back then or at least I didn't know up to this documentary is that Jim Carrey completely adopted being this character like full-time you know he was Andy Kaufman while they were recording this movie so from this documentary on you can really wonder who am I what forms my identity you know can you create something completely different than who you think you are basically but all in all it's just fascinating to see how he is during that time while they're recording the film how he looks at himself right now basically looking back on himself also recording all kinds of different movies and his success and how he looks at life basically and his own identity now yeah it's just fascinating to see and if you're a seeker of truth and freedom and self-love then I can just definitely recommend to check out this documentary of course I have shared last time around that you can now follow me on Spotify so I will share more songs on that Spotify account as well I have made some playlists by genre actually so you can also just check out some of my basically all-time favorites but for now in December like I shared before, I'm not really into the 80s sound. That's the only music that I don't really like or feel, you know. But somehow this song, again, Put Your Money On Me, is just so catchy. I just kept on repeating it and repeating it and repeating it this month. There's something in this rhythm that I really like. And then I don't know about you guys but December for me is really about more so relaxing kind of vibes concerning music as well therefore I thought maybe I can just share the album of the year or at least what I consider the album of the year which is the album of John Mayer who released this album in April 2017 already but I haven't shared any of his songs at least from this album and somehow this album was on repeat this month for me it's just perfect when you're having a glass of wine with friends or family or even when I'm working at night it's just the vibes are always good and I just really love this entire album I think it's really really good so I just wanted to share an entire album with you now but I'll just share one of the songs today so the album is called the search for everything what I actually personally really like is the theme So yeah, just listen to the entire album, then you get things like these. Moving on and getting over, but not the same it seems to me. Mm, 
now I can keep listening to it. That's why it's my album of the year. So once more guys, have a very, very happy 2018. May all your dreams and wishes come true. Somehow this number feels very good and very right for me. I think it's gonna be an amazing year. I wanna thank you all so much for watching. Keep letting love rule and I hope to see you in the next one. Love you, bye. So rock your world, so rock, so rock your world, bleh.